All right, you know the saying, right? A closet full of clothes <laughs> and nothing to wear. If you've ever, ever said it, raise your hand. This morning. <laughs> <laughs> Every morning. Okay, so how often do you think people say that? So we're gonna look at this right here. A one poll survey asked folks, okay, how often they look in their very full closet and say to themselves, I have nothing to wear. All right, let's change the graphics so we got that. Here's the three choices, once a month, six times a month more than 12 times a month what do you think i'm gonna go with the last one more than yeah. 12 times a month c c for final oh, answer everybody's yeah. saying c. okay yeah personal experience well <laughs> this survey respondent said this right here they said fickle fashionistas complain about having nothing to wear six mm. times a month but get okay. this Four in five of those same respondents say they rotate through the very same clothes week after week after week. And then, get this, on average, about $269 worth of outfits never make it out of the closet. They're just there waiting to be wow. worn. So are those stats surprising? Not too much, no. no. Yeah, I think the money part, though, I can agree. I'm like, oh, my closet, there's a lot of stuff. I'm like, oh, I haven't worn that yet. Shoes mm -hmm. included, not just, you know, clothes. That's yeah. true. Shoes included, not I, just clothes. That is a really good point. All right, sometimes it's our impulsive fashion choices, uh -huh. right, that keep uh, the clothes from being worn. But as I was looking into this today, one thing kept popping up. Look at this. It's the disorganized <laughs> closet. Are you looking at my husband's side of the closet? Uh, no, well, that, that's uh, Stacy's side of the closet. <laughs> right. Okay. Oh, no, mine is organized by color and everything. <laughs> wow. Oh, okay, so fancy. this other one poll survey was cited on organizedinteriors.com. It says one in four women admitted to having disorganized closets. 57% of them believe that having organized closets saves them time when picking out something to wear. Now, here's the thing. Um, it says just when you think they're on your side, it says 80% of household clutter is a result of a disorganization, mm. not a lack of space. And then if we can put that um, little thing down at the bottom, because I want you to be able to read all of this here. It says the best advice is use vertical space, keep your shoes on a shoe rack, have extra hanging rods added, and add space saving accessories. Mm. All right, so what do we think about that? When you think about your closet, I definitely think my closet's really tall, mm -hmm. but thin. And I think if I could do something vertically, that would help me. I need more space. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no matter what, right? Yeah, for me personally. So they have those hangers that are really cool. You can put multiple things on it and then it like kind of collapses yep. a little bit. Mm -hmm. The way that my closet is built, it has like, um, it's, it's divided in two, which kind of makes me run out of space a little bit because I would have a lot of work dresses. Long dresses. So yeah. it kind of, I don't have as many shirts as I have dresses to put on that top. So that divider in the middle kind of like makes me run out of space. I think sometimes though with the, the weather being wacky at times, not to blame mm. me at the meteorologist or anything, <laughs> but like some days you're like, I want to bring my spring stuff. So then you're in the spring section. Then you're like, I got to go back to the winter. So it's like kind of hard to organize it yeah, because it's all true. over the place. That's true. It's winter, mm -hmm. spring, summer, and fall in North Carolina yeah. sometimes in one week. All right. So yeah. I'll be the first to admit I'm disorganized. That's what happens. I'm just going to say it. And with that, let's go on to something better. Right.